Oh, the pulley's nearly off. I don't make it easy though. I'm using a couple of uh, clearance holes in the outside of it. Drive a bolt through. Put a nut on the inside. And just pull off that. This puller isn't big enough to go around the outside. Well, that's the end housing off. Probably a hundred years worth of dirt in this. At least. And it was originally installed in a wooden shack with an old two-cylinder or I think even a single-cylinder list of diesel engine. What's the end housing for you? Let's see that. It's windy and wet as hell out there now. Not very nice. Just getting ready to lift the rotor out. One good size rotor. Bearing surfaces aren't too bad either. Tiny little lines but there's no real step or wear in them. Com bars need a good clean and polish up. Definitely a good clean, that's about it. Some nice castings on these. Should clean up very well. Got the brush springs relaxed. They actually have little levers on them. Tensioning. replace all this wiring and just cut the leads for now because it's all broken down and crumbling I'll replace it with modern stuff clean within there I'll try and get that block out, I think I'll have to take this pole out to do it I didn't want to take these poles out but it looks like I have to now but overall is not too bad considering how old it is and how many hours it's probably run probably run for many years at a time or well, at least being a lighting plant it only run at night time but it's still done a lot of work okay folks I'm going to put this aside now and concentrate on these generators and things I've been given the go ahead to rebuild this generator or at least the bearings in it anyway and this generator here well I just thought I'd ask a question from my viewers and just try and get their opinion on what colours to use for this I know the original housing was sort of a matte blacky grey colour just a carbon black and that's what I'm going to stick with for the housing and end plates but somebody suggested painting the poles and the wiring on the rotor a different colour which really makes sense, it would look really nice I'm just wondering what would be the best colour contrast for it. I'll have a black, like a matte black outer housing with say green or red poles, field poles and I suppose colour code the poles and the windings on the rotor to the same colour. So I was thinking something along the lines of red but I 
just thought I'd ask my viewers what they reckon would be a nice contrast. I think red's a bit too glary, it's like a Honda thing really. This thing came out nice, but it'd look a bit funny having poles that colour on a generator that's probably three times as old as I am. So maybe a green colour or... No, blue's way too modern. Maybe white. Either way, just submit your opinions and whatever takes my fancy, I'll go with anyway, but I thought you'd like to have a bit of input on it. Thanks for watching, folks.